What is up, my people? It is your boy A M G here, and we're going to be talking about chapter 230 of My Hero Academia titled A Sad Man's Parade. Now, this is a very, very very short chapter it is only 12 pages but it has quite a bit of information we actually find out about twice as quirk in this chapter now what i thought and i'm pretty sure this is what many people thought that he could only quote make one clone and then that clone will clone another one so he would get the name twice and that's why he got it so it was like a clone of a clone of a clone that's what i thought but come to find out he can clone anything if he knows the contents of it. Like, he knows how it's made and everything. So, with that regard, he's kind of like Momo. How she can make anything as long as she knows what it's made of. Well, Twice can do the same thing, but whatever he makes is going to be weaker than the last thing he made. He's going to be weaker than the original. So, if it was a clone of a clone then the first clone would be stronger than the second clone. So it's kind of like how Naruto Shadow Clones are, where the next one is weaker when he makes so many. So it, pretty much the same thing, same concept right there. So that's pretty cool. And we see a panel where he tries to actually make the bullets that could take away quirks, but because he didn't know how it was manufactured, he wasn't able to mentally image it and be able to, you know, make more bullets so that's an interesting thing that we just you know got privy to um he actually starts going off on them and attacking everybody else and he got over his mental you know psychology that was going on because he was scared to use his powers and he found out he was the real one so that was the only reason why he wasn't using it so he goes to save everybody he goes to save mr compress then he goes over to see dobby and Dobby is fighting the ice guy. But before we talk about this, we see that Redestro is talking to the puppet master. And he's like, oh, well, it looks like you failed. And he was like, I didn't fail. It's just ready for me to do my next move. I have only failed once in my life. And I'm like, okay, puppet master, you hella cocky, but I, right, bro. <laughs> but um, then we see Goran, he's like, yo, you guys are great doctors, but if you get rid of all the mental blocks that they have going on, then you're going to get overpowered. You're pretty much, you know, overpowered now because they have so many people. But he's like, but we have quantity. Plus, we have somebody else. And I'm like, somebody else? And there's some kind of, I guess, kid or something that's supposed to be extra powerful. And sorry if you guys hear clicking in the background. But yeah, there's some kind of kid who's extra powerful. And I'm like who is the kid that he's talking about and oh by the way the guy's name is actually speck and it's apocryphy whoever i think that's how you say it and it was like who is that who's apocryphy don't know is that the ice users thing maybe so he must be one of the strongest ones well Dobby's fighting him and he's like how do you have so much ice do you guys make ice here? He was like, I told you I can manipulate ice. So basically, he can manipulate the temperature of ice. So he put water in the, he put ice in the sewers and then lowered the temperature and turned that into ice. So anything that's, I guess, a liquid form, he can lower the temperature and use it as ice and manipulate it. So that's pretty cool. That's a very interesting quirk how it works and the concept of it. So, it, I mean, use the ice powers or just people can use ice, but he actually manipulates the temperature and is able to use it. That's interesting. But then Dobby says he has an idea. He would like to use the ice use power to fight Giganto Machia. Interesting. And everyone's like, you sure about that? And the doctor even said, well, if you guys die, I'd make all from one look bad and i'm like okay interesting we also see that dobby can't use his power that long or he'll burn his own skin because his power is too strong so maybe he has never actually learned to fully control it huh that's 
very interesting. So I thought it was just a self-inflicted wound or maybe Endeavor burnt him because I still think he's Endeavor's son or something like that. But maybe it's just because of his own power. Who knows? That's some interesting stuff. You guys need to leave that in the back of your mind. Anyway, like the video if you like the video. Comment down below if you have anything you want to say. And subscribe to Meet Ya Boy AMG for more content. Remember, anime, manga, and gaming is all that. And I'm out, people. Peace.